Hey friends, this is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead. Well, I'm going to break down and try the new laundry soap. Now, it's not so that it's so much that it's new. It's just it's I'm going to do the powder version. Um, Howie brought me up the laundry soap bucket because right now our laundry is in the basement, and soon our bathroom's going to be under renovation so that uh, the laundry can be brought upstairs. But anyway, I want to try the powdered stuff because all you need for the powdered stuff is one tablespoon. So what you're going to need for this, apparently, is pretty much everything I put in my wet laundry soap now. You're going to need borax. You're going to need Arm & Hammer washing soda. You're going to need OxyClean. You're going to need two bars of laundry soap. I have three quarters of a bar of Thal's Nafa and a full bar of Octagon and you're going to need baking soda. All right, so the first thing, before I start spending half a day grating this soap, is we're gonna put equal amounts of the, oh look, there's a little scoop in there. I think I'll save that for his laundry. My husband's one of those men that thinks, oh this is hard. My husband's one of those men that thinks more is better. So we got to show him that one little scoop will do the job. Let's see if I've got this. This tells you how often I make laundry soap. And this, this OxyClean is a recent addition to my laundry soap. I thought I would try it and I'm actually liking the results. It doesn't do away with old stains like the one on my shirt here. But... Uh, it's it's making giving the laundry a much brighter look. Oh my gosh, this is oh there we go. Ah, uh, looks to be close to a cup. Oops. You want this powdered anyway, so if it's cakey, obviously my lid hasn't been on properly. Oh, all right. So we're gonna put in. One cup of OxyClean. Let's just dust this all in there. And we're going to put in one cup of borax. I'm going to put this all together in this and I'm going to shake it up. So there we've got our one cup. Well, not quite one cup. There we go. Now it's a cup of borax. Let's get our washing soda. Oh my gosh. I hope this isn't caked too. washing soda in there. It's starting to look like laundry detergent already. And I'm going to put in one cup of baking soda. And the baking soda for us is a good thing for the one very simple reason. is uh, We live in the country and our water has a tendency to be hard. Uh, it's not hard water really, but it's got a calcium buildup in it and baking soda is really good for that. So let's just put in a cup of baking soda. There we go. Now, let's get to grating our soap. Now, I'm going to use the really fine side of the grater to really kind of powder it down. See how nice and fluffy that is? And very, very, very fine. So, I'll be back when I have this and this grated up. All right, we are done. Now I'm going to switch this out to a bigger container so that I can shake this up. And plus, Howie's got great big paws. It'll be easier for him to uh, open and get his hand in there to get out the laundry soap. Now I'm going to say that this whole thing cost me about $4 to make at the most. Always put a lid on it folks. Don't just stir it up. This stuff can get up your nose and in your lungs. And, and there we have 
Oh, well, now we got some that are... Let's just break up the uh, lumps of the washing soda and stuff. Now I could fill this right up to the top, but how he would go from using this, which is actually close to two tablespoons, to this. So I'm going to put this, which is one tablespoon, because that's all you need for a load of lot wash. He won't believe me, but I'll make him do it. I'll be so glad when the laundry is upstairs where I can actually do it on do it myself on a regular basis. And there it is, folks. Homemade powdered laundry soap. One tablespoon at a time. No hot water, no mixing. Well, okay, some mixing, but no hot water and cooking of the soap. It's all just here, and you just put a level scoop. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead saying, simple is better. Thank you.